Any discoloration? No. But I'm okay. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go get you some ice. <laughs> oh, oh, no. I, I can't feel things like that. Like what? Like when I get smashed in the head with an ironing board. What? Uh, I can't feel pain. Oh, jeez, I'm crow. What the hell have I done to you? Oh, nothing. You're talking loopy. Listen to you going on about not being able to feel pain. That's delusional. No, I knocked this sense right out of you. No, I'm okay. Shh. I was going to be a nurse. So, I know. You're hurt. You just took a good shot right to the head, and that's serious. No, it, it's not serious. No, I don't think that an irony board could really hurt me, because, see, Irony board's on my list of things that can hurt you. <laughs> and besides, there's there's no blood or discoloration. Well, you can be so. hurt and not be bleeding or bruised. And also, my list is pretty reliable because my brother Paul is helping me make it. And irony boards are on the list. See, I, I can prove it to you. If I take this irony board right here, like this, and, and I smash you over the head with it, it won't hurt. Oh! Oh! That didn't hurt. Oh. Oh. What the hell was that? Why oh. did you do that? I'm sorry, did it hurt? Oh, God! <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, I, I didn't think of it because, oh. see, uh, ironing boards aren't on my list of things that can hurt you, but, oh. gosh, maybe they should be. <laughs> what are you talking about? I have a list of things that can hurt you. My brother Paul is helping me make it, and ironing boards are not on the list. <laughs> Well, that irony board hurt me. Yeah. So you should add it to your list. Yeah. I'm Steve. 
I live on floor three, room 11. I live with my boyfriend, Eric. I love him very much. Yeah. We saw you move in. Our roof collapsed from all the snow in December. We're just here until we can get our feet back on the ground. Well, that's good, because that's what Maud Dudley says her boarding house is all about. It's a place for people to live while they're trying to get their feet back on the ground. My brother Paul says that we've been trying to get our feet back on the ground our whole lives. Oh. Yeah. It, it takes some people longer than others. Yeah. You guys are loud. <laughs> <laughs> you and Eric. You yell and bang roaring below you. Oh. Sorry about that. We're just going through a rough patch. It happens. Sorry. What is it like? What? To not feel pain. I don't know. I don't know what it's like to hurt, so I I don't know. I I don't really feel. Is this how you were born? Oh yeah. Uh, I don't have fully developed pain sensors. They're immature, my brother Paul says. How does he and because that? Oh, he reads. <laughs> but and immature? because they're immature, my development as a human being has been retarded. <laughs> but so, are you but, but he teaches me what hurts. Why? So I don't ruin myself. Uh, I have to know what hurts so that I can know what to be afraid of. See, my mind doesn't know when to be afraid because my body doesn't know what it's like to hurt. So I have to memorize what might hurt. Okay. And I have to memorize what to be afraid of. Things like bears and guns and knives and fire and fear. I should fear fear itself. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Pretty girls. Pretty girls? Yeah. Why should you be afraid of pretty girls? Well, because Paul says that they can hurt you. Because they make you love them. And that's something I should be afraid of, too. Love. But Paul says that I'm really lucky because I probably won't have to deal with love. Because I have a lot of not very many capacity. Okay. This result of my congenital allergies yet. What do you mean? You're never gonna have to deal with love. Why? Oh, I'll never have to know what it feels like. How does he know that? Because it hurts. It shouldn't. And, and, and besides, uh, I have a lot of deficiencies and not very many capacities. Well, you know what? A lot of people do. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> well, is there any blood? <laughs> oh. Any discoloration? No. Then, I'm all right. I'm so sorry I did that. It's just, you're just very sweet. But, but, but you have a boyfriend and you love him very much. Yes, I do. And yes, I do. And y you just kissed me. Yes, I did. And, and it's Friday night and you're doing your laundry. <laughs> And, and people who are in love, they don't kiss other people. And they don't do the laundry on Friday nights. <laughs> they go out to the moose pad, or they go dancing, or they go skating together. And they kiss each other. They don't kiss other people. You know I, what? I, I don't think it's love when you and your boyfriend. I've been down here longer than I said I'd be, and he doesn't like that. Who? My boyfriend. Who you love very much? Yes! Even though you kissed me. Yes. Wow. I'm gonna have to tell my brother Paul about this. No! <laughs> Don't tell your brother Paul about this. Tell him to stop teaching you. What? Whatever it is he's teaching you, tell him to stop. 
The things he's teaching you, you don't want to know. But, look. But, but, but I, I have to learn from I was going to be a nurse. So I know. You need to see a doctor and not have your brother read whatever it is he reads. I, I gotta go. Right. You gotta go. You're leaving now. It's what people do. Oh, I, 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 I knew you would. I told you, it's just my boyfriend, Eric, he doesn't Who like it. love very much? Yes. He doesn't like it when I'm gone longer than I said I'd be. And if he's gone longer than I said it, ow! Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Oh my god, I can't believe I oh. did that to you. Ow! Oh, wait, 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 why did you just... Get married. Remember 
someone asked you that in December? It was snowing? Yeah. Yeah. Well, when I asked you that, you just, you got so quiet, and everybody said that that right there was everybody, all you needed everybody, to know. Who? Everybody! Who? Marvin said Marvin. Yes. 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 Marvin, Marvin said that? Like, she's said, an expert? How quiet you got was all you needed to know, and she's right! You don't love me. What? You don't know! And I've been trying to fix that. i tried to make you love me by giving you every bit of love that I had, and now I don't have any love for me left. That's not good for a person, so that's why I want it back, so I can bring it with me. With you? Where are you going? I need to get away from things. Get away from things? What things? There's, there's nothing in this town you need to get away from. Yes, there is. You! Me. Yes. You are the things in this town I need to get away from. Because I have to think! And start over, and so all the love I gave to you, I want it back in case I need it. Because I can't very well go around giving your love. That's all I have right now is the love you gave to me. I can't very well go around giving your love to other guys. That just doesn't other seem guys? Right. There are other guys? No. Not yet, but I'm assuming there will be. Ew. <laughs> now that I know that you're not ready to do what comes next, for people who have been together for quite a long time, I think we're going to be done. Ew. No, I'm so I, I think now the best thing we can do is just. Return the love we gave to each other and call it even. <laughs>
one door. I, I, I'm so sorry. Just, it was a Friday night, and I was sitting at home all by myself.
do it wrong. You gotta trick it. Trick it. Okay, okay. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. Roadkill. <laughs> what? Roadkill? Kill. Road kill? Dead raccoon in the middle of the road. No. No, Rhonda. It is not a dead raccoon. Okay, deer. Dead no, it's not a dead bloody, it's dead bloody deer not. in the middle of the okay, road. Okay, raccoon. Dead bloody raccoon. Raccoon? I'm not gonna make fun of you or nothing bad like that. I promise. No. No, I let's do the this thing. This thing. Is it <laughs> apples? Cherries? Strawberry? Big open face? Strawberry root bar pie? Dave. I see it. Next. Yeah? Well, why don't we go inside and I'll show you. Oh, I'm gonna take well, could take all night. 
Well, wait, we're working tomorrow. First shift. <laughs>